um, since our conversation this morning, something big was moved there. And on a deepest level, it feels very light and easy. But physically, it feels kind of not so pleasant still. Can you describe that more? Maybe you'll feel my throat kind of very tense. My head feels very heavy. And I also sense like a big craving for pleasure. Like um, something is wrong, you should feel good. And you don't feel good. And so there's something internally going on. Mm. Mm-hmm. But it's not like it matters too much right now, it's just what's happening. <laughs> yeah, I understand. And from your place of, of clear seeing, what do you see is happening on the personal level? Mm. Like I've touched something which has more to it. Mm. And it's going to come soon. Right. It's going to come undone. Yeah? And there is also some resistance to it. Of course. There is some deeper pain hidden there. Beautiful seeing. Could, um, uh, Ed, could you hit the lights just inside the door? And sometimes there is this voice that comes like, how much more can you do this? You keep finding something and then it feels fine and then something new comes up. Yeah. And it's so, I'm so tired of it. Like, yeah. you know, why can't you just live a peaceful life? Of course, of course. <laughs> that one who is so tired of it yeah. is the one who is going to fall apart and die. Right? The thing is, is that you keep thinking that that is you. You keep taking that to be, like, become identified with that. Whereas that is a level in you, which may still exist in personality forms, yet the realization of your deeper being is going to change the way that you show up on those levels, which means that there will be falling apart and dying. And that is going to possibly bring a contraction in the system. Yeah? And you know that, and that's why you came here. Right? It's like still some fight in me, the part of me that wants to go for it. Yeah. And I'm like, wow, you will have something again physical, because yeah. each time I go deeper in myself, something physical comes. Yeah. Like manifest well, what you can, when you can, what you can do yeah. is, um, this is really, really key. It's your key, you know. You are staying alone, I take it, yeah? So you have your space, yeah? Lay down on your bed and just give to the dropping. Give yourself the space to drop in Mm -hmm. into whatever is here. Just resting, resting, dropping through the layers. Meeting whatever if there is a layer of contracted resistance. Meeting that, not trying to get past that. Not trying to get Mm -hmm. beyond that. But just being there, experiencing that so consciously. And there is a an aspect of you which is just breathing open into that. Mm. Yeah? Breathing open into that. Because in your body, in your body, there will be contracted ways that the body is formed in reflection to a fabricated self. Right? So when you are dropping into that that contracted um, manifestation, when you start to just like, you are so present and you are so breathing and there is openness because you are open to it all and you're breathing it open. The body itself, it's like you are assisting a kind of undoing 
where the body starts to unwind what has been a, a, a tightness will begin to and you are just watching it, being present to it, breathing it open. And it is slowly, slowly unwinding itself. Mm. And there comes a moment where <gasps> a great big breath and boom, the whole thing drops. That was so beautiful how you described it. <laughs> and you come to the next level where you begin to see the subconscious. Mm. See the subconscious, subconscious movements around there. It is so beautiful. It is so beautiful. You know, to give yourself the space for that is the gift. Mm. If you don't take the space for that, that's when it will manifest in some other mm. way to throw you to the bed. Mm. I just saw that I have a tendency to bypass that. To bypass that and because therefore you have to yeah. get a broken this or that. Because there is this craving for pleasure and for bliss. Lust. Yes, for some high sensations, for something yeah. nice. And there is always a tendency to run away from the unpleasant yes. ones. Yes, yes. So that's what my so weak point. So beautiful to see yeah. that, isn't it? But the pleasure is right in the midst of that meeting. It's mm. another kind of pleasure. Yeah. It did feel pleasant as you described it. Mm. Such a beautiful way. Mm. It's delicious. But now I'm really looking forward to it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. The same seduction you use out there mm -hmm. turned <laughs> towards this. You know, I seduce you into it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> my, my skills as a seductress. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you.